One. Ha ha ha. Two. Ha ha ha. I've, I've got two for you. Guess which two they are. Stop that. I'm glad to see you made it past one though. Right guys, on this video we're going to look at one attack and see how many sort of different combinations and defences we can actually go for. What's this wee business? <sighs> if ever you find yourself in this position, what's the first thing you've got to do? Pay the bill next time and don't run out. <laughs> Okay, so we start off with the first part of the technique. Hold your breath. If Chris is stopping my airway, he controls my airway. If I hold my breath, I'm controlling my airway and I don't feel as panicky. What's a hairway? It's something you haven't got anymore. I have lost my hair, it's migrated. So we're gonna look at little techniques from this position. So Chris is gonna come in and we're literally gonna go from head to toe. So, you've seen the video before with the figure of eight. On the head, we've got downward attack, we've got sideward strikes, backward strikes, the hard soft routine, smack into there. You've also got the control of the head. Is he yet? You tell me. <laughs> I'm holding on for dear life here. So that's just basically empty handed. With one cane, up through the middle, chin shot, chin shot, mic shot, come down, I miss the mic from there. If you're on the outside and you're in this position, lengthen your cane a bit, you've now got the strikes to both sides of the head. If you reverse the crook, and you're up here, that on the top of the head is painful. You can come onto the scapula and pull down. You can come onto the um, collarbone, come down. You can angle in and come straight down the chest. With this, we're not doing the softening techniques, but if we're carrying on with the head, we've got the squeeze. Now you don't have just to squeeze here. If you get it across the cheekbone and do this technique. That is really uncomfortable. It really Thank you very much. Across the temples as well. Ow. So you've got, and of course, you've got the various, depending on the grips, all the, now I'm controlling my breathing and holding my breath, but if I think, do you know what, paybacks. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Female pup here. Yes. So you can do that. What I like to do is my thumb of doom. So I'm pulling that and my thumb into his carotid and... Oh yeah, I went gentle on you. <laughs> More for you. We got these techniques, striking, striking, um, striking. <laughs> Thanks for the warning, mate. It's more authentic that way. We're hooking. I like to hook from this way because then I go, look, by the power of my pinky. <laughs> <laughs> We've also got the one that Chris had a little while ago. So if I oh, God, just yeah. go, grab me. Don't get him. Choke your ribs out. The one he showed was around the neck, under the arm, and come up that way. Works better, I find, if you've got the cross on arm over, mate. Works better that way, I just find. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing flash. Elbows. Ow. <laughs> and then, you know that thing I did earlier? Yes. Now, I'm holding on for dear life. I like this one. I just thought, of, I've had an idea. Oh, God. So, rather than just doing it that way, what if I was to go chop the tree going down mm. there? So, the short, sharp bursts going down the ribs. Oh, nice one. I could do one better on that. Grab the throat. I was just about to go one better than that. But well, you can go one better after me. That's two. Now we've shown this attack. Didn't I? But if you attack, grab, attack, 
grab and you just keep going. It's not nice. <laughs> My turn. Were you into kind of like the monkeys and the mamas and the papas? Mm, yeah. So you're a hippie. <laughs> <laughs> you're going low now. I wouldn't say I'm going low, but <laughs> these very small. Well, before we go low, you got what? me again. Oh, it's all about you, isn't it? Well, I like I like your sort of cuddle technique because you're in close, so the cane comes up to the kidneys, <laughs> and you squeeze that way. I killed your cane. Ah. Cane is no more. Kwai Chang Kang. Yeah, I got you again. Donk. Oh no, I shall now pray for a technique which might work. Oh, let me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, that's you... not fair. Life's not fair, get used to it. Did you actually do the wrists? Well, I could do the wrists quite easily, but, the... <laughs> but I was thinking. You, that's a first for you. Now, I learned this technique in a slightly different manner. <laughs> but if I just decide to hook the knee, yeah. then actually stand on your knee and pull. You're not very nice. Ooh. Yeah. Toe tappers. You can't see that on camera, but I'm smashing his toes. Yeah, thanks for that, mate. Actually, no, you dropped your cane, grab your throat. Remember, the 5th of November. You got a tip, you got an axilla. Yeah. And you got a push of the tap. Ah, look at that, armpits of steel. Okay. <laughs> now, you may be thinking, what the hell are these two driveling on about for so long? Isn't that every video? Well, we'll let you know. Will we? Lots of techniques, but why are we doing all this? There's lots of options. Could it be... Logaria. Hang on. Just looking at my crystal ball. Could it be... Do that again and you'll have a pair. Could it be... <laughs> that this is all about our toolkit? It is. Now, if you do a technique as such, we say go to techniques. Now, if Kev is standing there on his two cane frame, meandering and I should put this down because I don't want him damaging my cane <laughs> and I grab him he's not going to go hmm I watched the video and there was 27 techniques no he'll do a flinch technique which would be for him it's that one which we didn't even cover no but it's again it's just my go-to flinch that's his go technique if he decides to grab me dun, 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 the, dun. the fall my reaction would be to bring this over there. <laughs> so using my chi power, I could just force him over. But bringing my hand up, breaking his balance here, and I would strike up here. Yeah. Some people, if you've got the grip this way, driving, hooking, striking. We're going into techniques again, but what you want is to practice without thinking, he's good at this, is to, with your training partner, it can be any attack and just go boff without telling them and you'll get your reaction for that technique and that's what you work on and the other 30 odd that you've seen there'll be ones in the toolbox actually Chris has come to a good point there that, that was an excellent point he grabs me <laughs> microwave <laughs> what are you doing with your cane sir you don't like putting that down do you so Chris is going to grab and he's a big strong lad, and for some reason, that's not worked. Fear reaction from your opponent, they may be that scared, I mean they've seen Kevin. But there has been, we, I say we train with a lot of reality people, yep. and they do say they've grabbed, people have grabbed them. In one instance, he actually broke both the guy's arms, and he was still holding on for pure fear. So the question is, do I keep doing this? trying to get the same result or I've tried that tried that tried that tried that ah, now you know why the cane tried there. that so if at first you don't succeed try something different that actually protected my groin then there's plenty of room 
Okay, we hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching. You got this far, you are a star. Don't forget to drop us a comment down below. Helps the algorithm and we are growing, thankfully. Yes, unlike Kevin, I think you're five stars, not one. Poor review, bad Kevin. Um, this was just not a set of how to do, but an idea so you get a, a flinch. You can try it with a punch, a kick, leaping out of the toilet when somebody thinks they're safe. Remember the fridge attack. The fridge attack. Revenge, okay, of, the, so. Revenge of the Pink Panther. Silly idea, but, but an actual it, idea. It works. It does. So, but if you are going to do this, pad up. <laughs> Please pad up. Or go very slowly. But you want that initial reaction. Uh, you're very good at that, aren't you? Surprise attacks. If only you remembered your lines and said something about, I don't know, three little buttons and three ferrets. Don't forget to subscribe, ignore Kevin, share, free the ferret, ignore Kevin, free the ring the barrel, free the ferret. See, so you've got me talking rubbish now. What's a barrel? <laughs> ring. It's just rubbing off on you. Ring the bell, free the fear, taxidermy the ferret, and cage that beast until you need it. If you'd like to see more about our flinch videos, there is a little box below me. You click on that, you get to a video you enjoy. And if you want to see more of the close-in stuff. Um, <laughs> exactly. You can't get a ferret in that gap, I'll tell you.